Good day everyone, you're watching Rate Your Fixes. On this video, I'm going to talk about how to fix in case if you're not able to open PowerPoint or if your PowerPoint goes to the not responding mode. Now, there could be a various reason why your application might go to not responding mode. The first and foremost reason would be the add-ons which are associated with the PowerPoint or um, the second reason it could be a printer um, because of the bad hardware uh, printer drivers your application might go to a not responding mode or the third reason it could be an issue with your security software or the fourth reason it could be an issue with the updates which are not being installed uh, latest updates which are not installed on your uh, for your office now the to start off with uh, what i would suggest you is i would suggest you to close all the applications which are running on your computer which is uh, which is for office you can keep the other application open and you will have to go to search in the search box you will have to go ahead and type run in the run window you will have to go ahead and type power pnt space forward slash safe and click on OK. Now what this will do is it will open up the PowerPoint in application safe mode. Now in case um, it is just like uh, running your windows in uh, safe mode. So but here in this case it is only a PowerPoint would be running in application safe mode and it will show up as Microsoft PowerPoint parentheses safe mode. So you will have to go to file. You will have to go to options. Under options you will have to go to add-ins. Under add-ins you will have to look for com add-ins click on go and see if there are any add-ons which are associated in case if there are any add-ons associated you will see the checkbox here you will have to uncheck this box click on uh, all the oh, click on ok now in case if there are any particular uh, if you want to identify which add-ons is causing a problem you will have to use divide and conquer method that is by unchecking each app add-ons and closing the application and try op or launching application normal mode see if that works in case if that works you will have to um, try application in safe mode and disable the ones which uh, to identify which is causing a problem so in my case I'm going to uh, keep this uh, two boxes unchecked click on OK and try opening um, the PowerPoint now in case if this uh, works it is pretty much clear that your add-ons are causing a problem so what you will have to do is you will have to go ahead and uninstall and reinstall the add-ons now in case if these step doesn't work now what I would suggest you is I would suggest you to close PowerPoint now in the search box you will have to type control open control panel and here uh, you will you can sort the view uh, in most of the cases it would be view by category and if it is view category you will have to change the view by a small icon or large icon and you will have to look for devices and printers and under devices and printer you will have to go ahead and change the default printer to either um, to a virtual printer apart from uh, the one which are using in my case I don't have any printer installed however I will change the printer to either to OneNote or to Microsoft PDF so what you will have to do is you will have to change your existing printer to uh, to a virtual different printer so what you can do is you can do a right click on it and click on set as default printer and try opening um, once you set this as a default different printer try opening the PowerPoint and see if, the, if it works in case if it works it is pretty much evident that it is your printer is causing a problem so what you will have to do is you will have to go ahead and update your printer driver restart your computer and um, try launching PowerPoint that should work now in case all these steps doesn't work uh, what I would suggest you is I would suggest you to go ahead and try repairing your office for which you will have to do is uh, you will have to click on the search box again go to in the search box you can go ahead and type app with dot cpl or you can type programs and features click on uh, click on this and this will open up the programs and features window in case if you're this window you can click on this uh, option which says related settings programs and features go to Microsoft Office 
click on change in case if you get a user access control prompt you can click on continue or yes and you can select online repair and click on repair so what it will do is it will repair all the dll files which are associated with your office and try to repair now this should, this should ideally work in case if all these steps doesn't work uh, what i would suggest you is i would suggest you to go ahead and up, um, update your office by by opening any of the office application in my case uh, let me try to open word since if the word is working fine you will have to open word click on file under file you will have to go to info and click on option which says update um, now you will have to go to account in most of the cases it would be under account and click on update option and click on update now so once you update your office you will have to close your all the office application restart your computer and try launching application that should work in case all these steps doesn't work the next thing is you will have to check if your security software is causing a conflict you will have to go ahead and disable your security software in my case i have avira so on the task manager you will have to do a right click and um, click on check the box which says enable real-time protection so different security software will have a different option you will have to disable that or you will have to go ahead and update your security software and restart your computer so all these steps should help you to resolve your powerpoint problem in case if you still have any problem please leave me a comment in the comment section i will leave you or uh, uh, provide you a possible solution i hope this video was useful in case if you like this video please make sure you hit the like button and do not forget to subscribe to my channel thank you for watching you have a great day